Okay guys, what I'm going to be showing you today is what you see right here, my background. You're going to be seeing this a lot in all my videos. Okay, first off, you're going to want to go find these brushes right here from Brush Easy. I use Brush Easy because it's free brushes, no royalties, no, none of those problems. I pause the video right here, copy down the link, whatever. Anyway, I'm going to bring up Photoshop. And obviously, you're going to need to change this. My Mac is a widescreen, 1440 by 900. Most people are going to have 1024 by 768, but depending on what your background is on your computer, change that to what you have. Anyway, first thing I usually do is take this layer, make a new one, delete the background. You don't have to, I do, just because it's a pet peeve of mine. I do not want red. <laughs> I don't want white, just a slate white default. D on your keyboard for a Mac. And then you're going to want to load your brushes. I'll have a video later on how to load brushes. And what you're going to want to do is get your swatches. And blood is actually not pure red like so many artists do. It's a little dark. And you'll see what I mean in a minute. What we're going to do, come up here, select the layer, <laughs> bring it up, you just start placing these brushes, and the key here, do not organize them, just random, you can place them in the center, I place them in the center because I'm not much of a full screen kind of background person, I guess you could say, don't organize, just randomly place them throughout your picture and you can do all of the frame but I just do the center it's gonna, starting to look pretty good here now I have a link to these brushes in my description on YouTube it's looking good there uh, change it a little bit more Those are two blotchy there. Let me add a few more. A few more. There we go. And there we are. And once you get it how you like it, it's going to vary every time you do it. You're going to make a new layer and you're going to add your text. And I use the verse from the Bible, Jesus died that we may live. You can use whatever you like. I just use this because it fit, blood pattern, you know. And my font black oak which i got from 1001fonts.com looks really good in red so i think you can see it takes a second to load there we go once you have your text made you can move it around and center it how you'd like and from here you can leave it like that if it looks good to you there you go what i like to do is merge the layers for easier control Go into your adjustments, go into hue and saturation, and you can make it any color you like. If you're feeling funky, it looks like alien blood, green, and do what you like. And there you go, guys. Um, quick plug in for my blog um, Photoshop blog, taylordaughtry.wordpress.com. I have a written tutorial for all of this, as well as this video. Um, it's just starting out, so make sure you guys subscribe to the feed, and thanks for watching.